The azimuth of the sun in Denver on January 20th, in the middle of the day, and we have a couple different possible uh, answers here. So uh, azimuth, there's, when I'm thinking about where the sun is in the sky, there are two key things I need to understand. Uh, so this is going to be a little tricky to draw, so give me a second. Uh, if that's my building, and that's north, Uh, and I'm in, you know, somewhere in the United States, say Denver. Uh, the sun is going to uh, rise and set uh, relatively sort of shallow off of due, uh, due east and set sh shallow off of due west. And in the middle of the day, it'll be roughly to the south, you know, somewhere in that range. So it's kind of going around like that. But it also has an angle upwards. Uh, so the sun is actually, say, up here. So there's our sun. And in the, you know, sort of one portion of the middle of the day, say it's a little bit off of due south, and it's uh, on an angle. So there's our angle up. So to place the sun, I need two numbers. One is, what angle upward is it? So if there's our little building, sun's up there, there's an angle there. And I also need to know where it is compared to the cardinal points. In this case, I'd be looking at it off of due south, because it's the middle of the day, that's where it's likely to be. So the solar angle, solar angle and the azimuth. So azimuth is the degree off of a cardinal direction. Cardinal direction means no, uh, south, north, east, west. Um, almost always, at least in the northern hemisphere, when you say azimuth, you're talking about off of the south, uh, but it can actually be off of any of them. So the only answer that makes any sense would be five degrees off of due south. So that one you kind of have to understand azimuth. I don't know that they would ask a direct question like that. Um, I think they might, uh, but it's also one I just wanted to be able to talk about sun angles, thinking about analyzing those things, and some of the terminology that you would use for that.